So, enjoy this. It's gonna be great. Uh, I want to talk about, uh, I got in a really, like, uh, like weird car accident uh, beginning of January. Remember we had that shit weather beginning of uh, January? Uh, I was driving, like, down Michigan Ave, um, and I ended up going in a ditch, and there was snow, like, around uh, the door handles, and I couldn't get out. But uh, like I, I just had to find help. Like, like I knew like AAA is not gonna come. Like it's they're, they're fuckers. Like I called them and they're like, well, dumb shit. Like <laughs> they're just asking, like, it's gonna be a three hour wait. Like I'll just do it. Fuck. I'll fucking do it myself. Fuck, 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 whatever. So I ended up like digging my car out, or like I dig myself out of the uh, out, like, out with a fireplace shovel. The struggle, the fucking struggle. <laughs> it was just there. I just dug it out, and then, like, it's freezing cold, it's like 15 below, um, and I see, like, this house that has, like, all these snow plows and shit, I'm like, oh my god, they can help me, so I go to there, and then I knock on their door, and it's this short little Mexican dude, and what does he say in this situation? Ah, no negro, no negro, no negro, no negro, I'm like, come on, dude, don't be fucking racist at this time, I'm cold as shit, I can die out here, and you're like, ah, no negro, no negro, no, 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 I'm like, come on, dude, like, that's just one of those you're black and you're like, oh, fuck this shit. Like, this, oh. I, if I was like two sh shades lighter, maybe, just maybe, you'd be like, oh, come in for some tea. Ah, uh, no, no negro, no negro. <laughs> Asshole. But he drove me back uh, to my girlfriend's house. And uh, no, but like, the thing was, like, he had this 19 year old son where he's like, he's been saying, like, no negro, no negro. His 19 year old son's like, but papa, he would freeze. <laughs> I'm like, God damn right, listen to your son! <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I'm gonna kick some new shit for you guys. That's just, it's, it's just, uh, you know, that's just how it is being black in America, I guess. I don't know, it's weird. Uh, I remember I was driving up north with my grandma, we were going to uh, golf near Garland. And when we were driving there, she's like, I want you to know that uh, up north Michigan is a lot different than this Michigan. And I was like, how is that? She's like, oh, this is wild. there's hunting and there's white people. And you might, it's just going to be a little weird for you. I'm like, how? And this is how it got weird for me. We stopped at a gas station. I was eight years old. All I wanted was some fucking Twizzlers. Okay? I went up right to the counter and the lady's like, wow. I'm like, what? She's like, we just don't get too many y'all around here. And, can I touch your skin? It's soft as butter, oh god. Like Paula Dean was just in this gas station. <laughs> like, I want to fix you something, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, I got some new shit. Oh man. Uh, did you guys hear about Philip Seymour Hoffman dying? Uh, we're not gonna see more of him. <laughs> He fucking OD'd. Uh, I love that shit. When I saw it on Facebook, one of my friends was like, I bet it's a fentanyl and it's heroin. I thought it was a fucking heroin. It is heroin. I don't care what you put in heroin, you still gotta ride the dragon, bitch. Like, oh my god. Oh. You guys, you guys keeping up uh, with the Olympics? That's bullshit. They got the Olympic Village like finished. Uh, it's great. It's great to be an Olympian there. It sucks to be like uh, like part of the press or whatever. And everything's like so cheap over there. I thought, you know, if you win a gold over there, like what's the possibility of you flipping the like the medal over and it says so cheap, probably gold. Like, <laughs> eh. I think the reason why it's so shitty is because they didn't hire a gay event planner. You need one. Like, and they don't like the gays over there. That's all right. Uh, you guys have seen any movies lately? I want to go see, uh, did you guys ever see that movie, uh, 12 Years a Slave? No, you didn't. <laughs> I want to make my own movie called 12 Years a Slave, but it'll just be about a guy paying back his college loans. <laughs> oh, God. I love going to see, like, movies with, like, mostly a black audience, just for the commentary. Like, I went to go see, uh, the Six Harry Potter movie, and it was really funny, because there's this one scene where, like, like, Dumbledore's got the, the, I don't know, he's like dying or some shit. It doesn't look good for him, right? These two black guys are sitting in front of me, and one's like, Man, I don't think I think a Dumbledore gonna make you. I don't think he gonna make you. He's like, man, you don't know why he's Dumbledore like that? 
And so what does he do? He's just like, and then at that moment, like, Dumbledore drank the potion, got up, and just starts firing, like, this hot lava on all these zombies, like, oh, I told you, man! Dumbledore don't ever let me down! <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, man. Uh, I just love that. Like, if I go, like, black people love the struggle. Like, if this was an all-black audience, all I would have to do would be on your side, like, anybody ever had to pay a hot water bill before? They'd be like, oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh my god, he gets it! <laughs> oh shit! Uh, one of my friends the other day, like, she asked me, uh, Hey Tanner, like, what's your spirit animal? Like, you know, if you're like a strong person, you're supposed to get like a tiger or a lion or some shit. I am inherently lazy, so I already know what my spirit animal is. My spirit animal is a fat security guard that's clutching his chest after eating too much diamond chili. Like, he's just, he's done. He's just like, yeah, there's a strap left there, but, fuck, whatever. <laughs> oh, God. What else can I say to you guys? Uh, I shot my first turkey the other day. Congratulations, yeah. Scared the shit out of everybody in Whole Foods, though. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. You guys smoking here? Like, weed? Because <laughs> I do. <laughs> uh. Do you smoke? <laughs> you should. <laughs> Oh my god, I swear to god, if weed is not completely legal in five years, I'm heading to Canada. You guys are not fucking do it. Oh man. Uh, actually, that's a funny story. Um, the room that I run downtown is like this little coffee shop uh, full of hipsters. And before I used to host it, it was like a music slash comedy venue. And this one rapper showed up one day, he's like, Hey man, my name's Drezilla. I got a demo for you all, but I think you should check it out. So then he like did his uh, whole like rap routine, and at the end of it, he was like, "Hey, you should check out the grow up." I'm like, "What's the grow up?" He's like, "Oh man, we're just going, we're just going real good shit down there, real good shit." I'm like, "All right, cool." So he shows up the next time, does two songs, but then at the end of it, he pulls out a duffel bag. And I'm like, "What's inside the duffel bag, Black Santa? What's inside?" <laughs> And he just starts throwing dime bags to everybody. It was like Christmas. It was great. <laughs> that should have been there. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I'm from the suburbs, so I fuck white women and I'm not gonna stop. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry. Uh, you know that, uh, that saying, like, once you go black, you never go back? Uh, I gotta do it for you guys. Once you go black, you don't smell anymore. Because this girl is giving me dome. That's just what you call it when you're a black guy and getting your dick sucked. Uh, <laughs> and uh, my mom walked in, and I didn't want to see my vinegar strokes. And if you don't know what vinegar strokes is, just stick some vinegar underneath your man's nose and go like, huh, that's the that's the face you make when you come. A little vinegar strokes. But uh, I just I was so scared of my mom coming in. I just kicked her just straight in the face, and now she can't enjoy breakfast food anymore. Uh, but that's my time, you guys. Thank you. <laughs>